goat who has what looks to me to be basically a classic pneumonia. Last night, about 12 hours ago, um, she was just off. She didn't want to eat, but she seemed fine otherwise. Today, she's more or less down. She'll get up if I go mess with her. But you can see she's kind of breathing funny, sort of thumping when she breathes a little bit. Um, she's got snot coming out of her nose. And so I'm going to go ahead and treat her with an antibiotic. And the three options that I have, um, LA-200, which is an oxytetracycline. I have uh, Tylosin and uh, penicillin. I'm gonna go with the Tylosin. The Oxytet um, is not a safe one for pregnant does. You wanna avoid that when you're pregnant, so that's a no-go. Penicillin has kind of been used so much that it's not being shown to be too effective against a lot of the cooties that animals get. So I'm gonna go with Tylosin and hope it, hope it uh, makes her feel, hopes, hope it makes her feel a little better. She's about 150 pounds, so she's gonna get six cc's intramuscularly. Um, today and then we'll continue for at least several days up to five is what it says on the label so that's the plan hopefully she makes it she's due to kid in about two weeks of course that's how it always works okay she got the shot and she's also had six cc's of vitamin B just because anytime these small ruminants are off vitamin B is a good idea especially goats who tend to get um, polio with uh, thiamine deficiency so Anytime their rumen might be kind of compromised, vitamin B is a safe, a safe option that, you know, it's not, you can't overdose it really by giving it every day. Um, it's just a good idea. So that's what we're going to do. Her, her treatment's going to consist of uh, Tylen 200, uh, 6 cc's intramuscularly for up to 5 days, and vitamin B complex 10 cc's every day for, uh, maybe a week it seems if she you know she starts getting back on food and stuff and then uh we'll you know maybe maybe stop that or reduce it or something but that's the plan we'll see how it turns out wish us luck <coughs> well, that is her there on the end this one here and she is back to wanting to eat a little bit it seems to be doing pretty good. Kind of slow. Shush. But still doing pretty good. Today was the last day of treatment, day five, and she looks to be doing really good. Out here walking around outside, she ate good this morning. She's as content as she can be. She's old and she's super pregnant. She's due in about a week now.